cranio vertebral junction anomaly dvj is the site of multiple congenital developmental abnormalities and the abnormalities can be due to secondary to any disease process that includes both bony and soft tissue abnormality this pathology can decrease space for lower brain stem and spinal cord the cranio vertebral junction includes the occipital condyles c1 or that less c2 or the axis and their articulations the joints between the occipital condyles and the atlas and atlas and axis are the synovial joints we will discuss the clinical features of cranio vertebral junction anomalies this can occur at any age or patient can remain asymptomatic the presentation is often insidious it can be precipitated by a trivial trauma on examination there can be facial asymmetry deafness the deafness is due to auditory canal abnormalities or microtia there can be lower cranial nerve palsies transient ischemic attacks due to vertebral artery compressions posterior occipital headache which is a characteristic features of cvg abnormality cleft palate there can be webbing of neck short neck torticollis scoliosis kyphosis and sprengel deformity which is characterized by a high scapula the musculoskeletal abnormalities can be cervical ribs congenital fusion of ribs abnormal costovertebral joints syndactyly hypoplastic thumb supernumerary digits then hypoplasia of pectoralis major hemiatrophy of upper limb and lower limb congenital talipus equinovarus and sacralagenesis the renal system abnormality can be renal agenesis horseshoe kidney hydronephrosis renal ectopia in cardiovascular system is associated with ventricular septal defect patent rectus arteriosus coarctation of aorta and patent foramen ovale there can be synkinesia which are involuntary paired movements of hand which are mirror like movements these are the clinical features of cranio vertebral junction abnormality